Hey guys, this is Rich from Rich TV Live, and I read this news today. And happy Thanksgiving to all our friends in America. Hope you're enjoying your holiday, and I hope you have a great day with your friends and family. I just wanted to bring some breaking news here. Florida medical cannabis leader truly projects 214 million in revenue in 2019 and begins national expansion. This is huge news. This is a company that is relatively new, and for them to generate $219 million in 2019 will be enormous. Wow. So the vertically integrated company TrueLeave, T-R-U-L on the CSC, the Canadian Securities Exchange, and TCNNF in America, which began trading publicly in late September, only two months ago, is coming off a strong th third quarter that generated revenue of $28.3 million, all from just within the state of Florida, where it employs 1,300 people. The company continues to expand in Florida and just announced entry into two new markets, Massachusetts and California. Wow. CEO Kim Rivers spoke with New Cannabis Ventures about the company's Florida presence, M&A strategy, and vision for the future. Rivers worked in private practice law doing M&A and securities work before transitioning to the private sector and working with a number of different businesses in industries like hospitality and IT. Intrigued by the business opportunity presented by the cannabis industry, she started to do her due diligence. It became clear that profitable companies could be built in the cannabis space, but Rivers was also drawn to the disruptive potential of the space, particularly when it comes to opioid epidemic. True Leave in Florida. Rivers strives for True Leave to balance a startup mentality with growing scale. The company has approximately half a million square feet of cultivation space. Wow. 22 retail stores and 1,300 employees in Florida. Additionally, the company is moving into a new 55,000 square foot production facility. Each week, the company manufactures more than 55,000 products. In the past, the company has onboarded approximately 2,200 patients per week, but that number has grown significantly over the past three weeks. True Leave has brought on 3,000 to 4,200 patients per week. Wow. That number is staggering, according to Rivers. With the possibility of adult use coming onto the state's ballot in 2020, the new product segments entering the market, Kim is confident new patients and consumers will continue to enter the Florida market. What do you think about this news? Now remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here on Rich TV Live. While new patient acquisition is ramping up, TrueLeave is taking a long-term approach to the patient retention. The company prices its products to be nationally competitive. Rivers observed that there is often an assumption that high revenue translates to higher prices compared to more mature medical markets such as Arizona, but TrueLeave keeps its prices in line with markets on a national level. They can look at one of the locations. This is the exterior of a True Leaf dispensary in Tampa, Florida. The state requires cannabis companies to be vertically integrated, which has led True Leaf to gain expertise in cultivation, processing, manufacturing, and distribution. Rivers envisions this experience will allow the company to translate its success to other markets while continuing to grow a leading presence in Florida. This is the interior of a True Leaf dispensary. Mergers and Acquisition Strategy, M&A Strategy. TrueLeave is expanding into two new markets, Massachusetts and California. Through strategic acquisitions in the target market of Massachusetts, the company examined and passed on a few more significant deals before settling on an acquisition that would allow the company to grow strategically. River saw a number of companies focused heavily on the retail rather than building supply chain. She foresees a supply shortage in the state, which could create a bottleneck the deal which is exactly what they want the deal the company exec executed involves a 127,000 square foot cultivation facility which will paired with strategic retail locations in California truly decided to enter the market with a partner that has successfully navigated the changing regulation environments of the state River sees a significant opportunity to build a branded presence through the Palm Springs retail location and company acquired and to begin to work with other cannabis companies in the state. The company is continuously looking at potential acquisition deals. Both single state and multi-state opportunities are on the table for discussion, according to Rivers. I love this company. Hey, truly, contact your boy. I got a bunch of 
acquisition targets for you. Planning for future success. The company projects $214 million in revenue in 2019. When it comes to finding, maintaining success in the U.S. cannabis market, Rivers is betting on a strong team, a clear vision, and the flexibility to pivot when the market inevitably changes. While regulatory changes are a clear challenge for all players in the space, she also sees this as an opportunity for companies to differentiate themselves through their ability to successfully execute. While TrueLeave is grounded in business fundamentals, Rivers is keeping the human element of the work her company is doing, the ability to affect quality of life, and the forefront of her mind. What do you think about this news? Breaking news, $214 million in revenue in 2019. That may make them number one in the world. That's right. That could make them number one in the world. And their revenue is very similar right now to that of Canopy Growth and Aurora Cannabis. And with their projection of $214 million in revenue in 2019, if they hit those numbers, that means they will be doing $50 million a quarter, which is roughly double what they're doing right now. What do you think about this news? If you like it, smash the like button. Comment down below. I want to know what you think about this. Do you have this on your watch list? Do you have it on your radar? I believe they are going to be a powerhouse, long-term giant in America alone. Forget internationally what they could do. All right. Holler at your boy. Happy Thanksgiving to everybody. I'm out. Peace. I love Truly. Big winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. If you're not winning, you're not watching. Your boy Rich. And I'm out. See ya.